parks are legal in Pueblo County, but that doesn't mean everyone will have a great 4th of July. Yeah, pause for life will not do pet adoptions until after the holiday weekend. They're afraid fireworks could scare those new pets. Carradio News Channel 13's Carl Winder shows us how one pet owner learned that the hard way. Fireworks lighting up the night sky. It's one way to celebrate America's birthday. But for Jean Engel, it's been a stressful week. Well, last night, uh, my granddaughter's dog heard fireworks and ran away. Her dog, Boo, was found, but not in the condition she expected. She does have a fractured pelvis, so uh, we need to take care of that, and hopefully she'll heal well. Engel is one of many pet owners whose pets ran away this week because of fireworks. It's our least favorite week of the whole year, but we stay really busy. More animals are lost and found and scared and hurt um, the first two weeks of July than any other time of the year. Pause for Life says one way to make sure your pets don't run away during the 4th of July is to keep them at home. Don't take them with you. They don't know the environment they're in. They get scared, they run, and they won't know their way back home. Don't leave them out in the backyard and decide to go to your friends for a barbecue and, you know, come home at 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning, you won't find them. As for Angle, instead of fireworks on the 4th of July, she will be by Boo's side to make sure she gets better. In Pueblo, Carl Winder, KRDO News Channel 13. Thanks, Carl. Well, if you are looking to get a pet this 4th of July weekend, Pueblo Animal Services is doing adoptions, except they won't be doing it on the 4th. And for a complete list of fireworks celebrations in Southern Colorado, head to our website, KRDO.com.